In just the past 30 minutes, a fourth potential juror got dismissed in the trial of former Tulsa police officer Shannon Kepler, who's charged with murdering his daughter's boyfriend. News on 6's Joseph Holloway is live for us at the Tulsa County Courthouse with why, were they, why they were dismissed. Joseph? Dave, the judge just brought in four new jurors to replace those four dismissed ones. Now, three of the new potential jurors all have already admitted that they had already heard about this case prior to today, and one of them even admitted that he had already formed an opinion about it. So now, both the state and the defense will get to question them. Now, of the four dismissed potential jurors, the assistant DA tells me that one of those potential jurors got dismissed because of school obligations, while another posted about the trial on social media last year. The, AD, the ADA excuse me, says that a third juror was let go because they were going to have trouble finding child care. We're still working to find out why that fourth one was dismissed. Now, that makes for a total of six potential jurors that have been let go so far. They started with 60 people in the jury pool yesterday. The judge said that the other prospective jurors should enter the courtroom after lunch. Kepler is charged with murdering Jeremy Lake in 2014. This case has gone to trial three times now, and all three trials ended with hung juries. News on 6 will be at the courthouse all day, and of course, we'll bring you the latest updates when the jury is selected, and make sure to stay tuned to our News on 6 mobile app. Make sure to download that if you have not already. Reporting live on the scene on the story at the Tulsa County Courthouse, Joseph Holloway, News on 6.